ever since I was little, I wanted like, you know, that perfect stomach. So I never had it even before I had babies. You know, Valerie is a very typical patient. She's, uh, after having a few children, she looked at her stomach and she's concerned about the loose skin, the stretch marks, and her stomach doesn't look like the stomach that she remember having when she was uh, before having children. I lost all elasticity in my stomach and wearing a bathing suit or wearing a nice pair of jeans, you know, and having, you know, the skin overhang was just uncomfortable for me and I, that's the part that was my main issue. Also, um, you know, after having kids, um, you know, my breasts are very small and I have a lot of, they're pretty sagging and basically Objective is just to go in and have a little bit more volume, not have to cinch them up so tight, you know, in a bathing suit or uh, be able to wear a strapless top and not be, um, you know, so flat as I am now. So that would probably be my second issue is um, to maybe give my breasts some more volume. Her breasts haven't um, aged well since her pregnancy and her childbirth. So she wants to have them look a little bit more youthful, a little bit firmer to make them look more perky. So I recommend that she had the breast augmentation done at the same time as her uh, uh, tummy tuck. Um, I chose Dr. Nguyen because I have heard way too many other doctors say how wonderful and amazing he is. And I've had the opportunity to see his before and afters and the recovery time and i um, excited to do it. She was scheduled to have a uh, breast augmentation, the tummy tuck, and the liposuction of her flanks. Um, so prior to the surgery, we all, uh, always mark the patient before the surgery. And when we look at the breast, we want to make sure that uh, the breast, if one breast is smaller than the other, we would make sure that we fill that side a little bit more to try to improve the asymmetry that existed before. We can't ever make them perfectly symmetric, but we try to improve this uh, symmetry. Uh, we mark the incision on her abdomen so that she knows where the scar will be. And I also discussed with her with regard to the type of bikinis that she liked to wear so we can design the scar in the appropriate position so that she will be able to wear the kind of bikinis that she's uh, comfortable with. Uh, Valerie, uh, from her pregnancy, has significant amount of loose skin on her abdomen. So we took a, a pretty substantive amount of skin from her abdomen. We also tightened her muscle to give her a better muscle tone. Uh, we removed the fat from her flanks to give her a narrower waist. But the good thing about uh, doing the tummy tuck and the breast augmentation together is that we can do the augmentation through the tummy tuck incision so that she does not have any scar on her breast, so that now her breast will look perfectly pristine and there's no scar on it at all. In general, what we have to do is we have to make a new belly button for the tummy tuck procedure because we remove so much skin. We remove the whole amount of skin from the pubic hair up to the belly button, so we have to create a new belly button for them. But it's a good thing because most of the time after a few pregnancy or some pregnancy, uh, the belly button doesn't look that attractive anymore. So the new belly button that we create is a lot more attractive. I saw her. Uh, after the surgery and she was very comfortable, she didn't have any problems, so it has been a very, very smooth course for uh, Valerie. I want you to slide on your back, okay? Come on, keep on coming. Stay on your back, or Suzanne will do it all by herself. <laughs> We're all done. We're going to the recovery room, okay? You did great. Just come mm. out of surgery. What do you think? It was really fast. Second you shut your eyes, next thing you know, you wake up. So it's it's nice and it's easier to go into surgery knowing that the second you close your eyes, you'll you'll be awake and recovering the very next second. I can't wait to see my belly, but yes. she looks good for just coming out of surgery. Bye bye. Right, thanks. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you. I had the abdominoplasty and the breast augmentation. Um, lipo. We lipoed the flanks as well. Um, and just feeling amazed. I am 
I feel great. Imagine in just four weeks that I'm already wearing my clothes again. I'm wearing the, my same pants at home, but I still have a little bit um, swelling going down here. It's only been four weeks, so I'm, I'm able to button my pants um, and they're fitting way better, but I am so excited to see even after four more weeks how how much more, it, you know, easier it's gonna be to button my pants. I just can't wait, I'm really excited. Going into surgery, um, it was a Tuesday. Um, spent Wednesday and Thursday laying down resting, and by Thursday afternoon by lunch I was up, and walking around I was folding laundry on my lap. I was up and going, so. Definitely that's the key, you gotta get up and move. And by day two, I felt great. I was back to work in seven days. Wow, I love this. I'm able to wear jeans again and button them. I love it. I love it. And wearing a top without anything, I just love it. Quick tan this summer and I'm gonna be set. I'm gonna be ready to go, I love this. Look at my new stomach. No overhang on my pants anymore, it's gone. It's all gone. I'm able to button them with ease. This is what I wanted. This is good. I like them. I'm going to go try on the other outfit now. How excited. I, there's not even words for it how, how neat it is to go and put on a pair of pants and, and just zip them up and button them and, and to have them look great and to, you know, see my stomach now flat and have a nice, beautiful, small belly button. That, that's the belly you know, that I see everywhere, the belly that I really, really wanted, and um, I have that now. So this is my new stomach. Um, stretch marks before ended up, were way up into this area. So we brought all of this down. I wasn't conscious about the stretch marks, that wasn't my issue, it was the skin. All, most of us moms who have had babies will end up with some kind of stretch marks after they have their babies. Um, that wasn't my main concern, it was, this, it was the skin. I think I am just so happy. The trade that I gave for, you know, the surgery, it was, it was such an even trade. I mean, I, I'm definitely impressed. I'm happy with the uh, results. I have a nice, small, little belly button there and my stomach is flat. My goal is accomplished, I'm just really lucky. Um, I would recommend Dr. Nguyen to anybody. Um, things have changed with um, our, my home life, with my husband. He's very excited. I'm very excited. Things are, there's definitely um, a spice to things. <laughs> our sex life is just out of control. <laughs> oh boy. Yep. It's fun. Out of control. And it's great. <laughs> It's great. Never used to be like that. No. Don't have to shut the lights off anymore. How funny. I used to be that. I used to be that way. I mean, maybe with the TV on, a little bit of a, um, you know, low light is okay. But doesn't bother me one bit now. No, the lights are on and it, it can be anywhere now. <laughs> In any time of the day. <laughs> you know, it's exciting. It's fun. It's fun to lay there and go, hey, look, look at this. Look at this. You know, I would never be able to do that before. Look, you know. Look at this way or that way, and we, we play around together. It's fun. It's like um, it's still me, but there are just um, there's some improvements through this whole process. Um, I've gotten to fall in love with him all over again, and it's very it's an exciting, neat thing to get to know him in a whole new way now, and to get to know each other as now a husband and a wife, not a mommy and a daddy. Once you feel good about yourself, you're able to accept and feel love. So. I think that's what happened, you know, once um, I was holding back a little bit and um, in turn you end up holding back from the relationship as well and um, not allowing your partner or your husband to um, give his all. I think it's very exciting to see the patient after uh, a successful surgery. They look great, they feel good and they're very, usually very, very thankful. Thank I'm, you very much. I'm so happy for you. Thank it's my you. pleasure. You're welcome. Dr. Nguyen changed my life.